If you're worried about keeping your dog safe and secure in your yard, a PetSafe wireless pet containment system could be a great option for you. And best of all, I'll show you how to set it up without digging. So first, you'll want to select a unit that's right for your pet and your yard. Now this wireless system is made for dogs over eight pounds and covers an adjustable circular area of up to half an acre. The transmitter or base unit is the center point and it sends out a signal 90 feet in every direction or less depending on your needs. In this video, I'll show you how to set up the system, but proper training of your pet is essential for its success. After you install the system, be sure to check out the training guide included in the manufacturer's instructions. The first step is to decide the best place to put the transmitter. It needs a standard 120 volt outlet that's protected from the weather and won't drop below freezing. Since it transmits a circular barrier located in the middle of your dog's roaming area. Also, it needs to be positioned on the first floor of the house. It can transmit through walls, but keep it away from large metal objects like the furnace or refrigerator since these can interfere with the signal it sends out. I'll start by plugging it in and setting it on a table or a counter now I'm gonna wait to mount it until I figured out the best position for the boundary I wanna create. Turn the power on, set the boundary switch to high, and turn the boundary control knob all the way up to eight. Next, I'll get the receiver collar ready. I'll install the special battery by lining it up as indicated. The collar gives off an audible beep when your dog is getting near the boundary, but it can also generate a static correction signal through the contact points. This doesn't hurt your dog, just lets him know when it's time to turn around. To activate this feature, just remove the clear plastic cover and press the correction level button on top until the indicator light flashes. It'll flash anywhere from one to four times to indicate the correction level. When training your pet, start on level one. You may wish to adjust this level after the first day, so refer to the manual. Next, I'm gonna set up the perimeter of the yard, and the best way to do that is with a helper and a pair of cell phones, but you can also do it alone. Just check the instruction manual for more information. First, I'll hold the collar at the height of my dog's neck and walk to where I want him to stop in the yard. My friend inside slowly turns down the boundary control dial from eight. When the receiver collar starts to beep, stop turning the dial. So now your perimeter's set and it's time to place your boundary flags, which are critical for training your dog. Again, walk towards the edge of your yard. When the collar begins to beep, place a flag. Walk back into your yard and again towards the edge. When the collar beeps, place another flag. You'll want to repeat this, placing flags about every 10 feet until you've created a visual flag fence. And these are going to stay up until your pet becomes familiar with the boundaries. Now the final step involves your dog. Make sure he's standing while you fit the collar. Center the contact points underneath the neck, assuring that they touch the skin. Tighten the collar until you can insert one finger between the end of the contact point and your pet's neck. You'll want to periodically check the collar's fit and clean the contact area on your pet's neck weekly. Discontinue use of the collar immediately if you see signs of a rash or sore and see your veterinarian. And that is all for the setup of this wireless system. But remember, this is not a solid barrier and properly training your pet to stay within the boundaries is really important for his safety. Be sure to be patient and consistent. For more information on training, refer to your manufacturer's instructions. If you're looking for more ways to improve your home, check out all our other how-to videos at lowes.com slash videos. If you're worried about keeping your dog safe and secure in your yard, a PetSafe wireless pet containment system could be a great option for you. And best of all, I'll show you how to set it up without digging. So first, you'll want to select a unit that's right for your pet and your yard. Now this wireless system is made for dogs over eight pounds and covers an adjustable circular area of up to half an acre. 